If this quadratic function is a perfect square, find the value of c. Let me tell you something. If you can remember this formula x equals minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac divided by 2a. This formula is very very important. It is being derived from the method of completing the square. You see the terms under the square root b squared minus 4ac will help you to find the real value of this c. If b squared minus 4ac, if the value under that square root is equal to 0, so it means the quadratic equation is perfect squared. If the value is greater than 0, it means the quadratic equation has real and distinct root. But if the value of this b squared minus 4ac is less than 0, that quadratic equation has imaginary roots. It has no solution. So let us test for this. In this equation, you know a is going to be equal to 4, which is the coefficient of x squared. b is the coefficient of the middle term, which is minus 12. And uh, c is the same thing as c. So we are going to substitute into this formula. We start with the very first one, which is b squared minus 12 squared minus 4 multiplied by a, which is 4 also, then times c equals 0. This is 144 minus 16 c equals 0. Now, if you take this one to the right hand side, it becomes positive. So we have 144 equals to positive 16 positive 16 c you divide both side by 16 by both side by 16 so therefore c equals 9 and which is the option b